So you can rotate things, but you want to control it with the press of a button. Not a problem. Shout out to Ixie for sharing the blueprint schematics for this. Really appreciate it, man. You're awesome. Now, if you followed the last video, you should have something like this. First, under the class defaults, on the right under details, under input, change auto receive to player zero. Otherwise, none of this is gonna work. Once you've done that, if you wanna save nodes, you can actually split up the rotation values. And then you don't need this make rotator node. Now, in order to change it so it responds to when we hold the E key, right click and type E until you find the key node. Then add a new boolean variable that is controlled by whether the E key is pressed or released. Drag it out twice, with one set to true and one set to false, and then drag it out one more time, but this time we want the get. Then add a branch node and connect them together like so. You're done. If you run the game now, every time you hold E, your object will now rotate. Hope that helps, and as always, hope you have a fantastic day, and I'll see you around.